If you asked the AI chatbot of your choice to help design a smartphone with the best specification possible, it might come up with something similar to the Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra, which itself is packed full of AI smarts. After all, there's very little missing from the top Galaxy model with everything from a stylus to the very latest processor included. Does this mean you shouldn't think twice about buying it? Let's find out. The Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra embraces what it means to be Ultra, a phone that transcends the smartphone category. It offers more than any other phone and somehow manages to improve upon last year's Ultra in every way. The Galaxy S24 Ultra has better battery life, faster performance, and even better cameras, so you will also pay a bit more for the improvements. The new AI features are the only things that can slow this phone down except for Samsung's aging and terrible software, which buries every exciting thing under layers upon layers of settings and menus. When you see the Ultra in action, it's worth the price, and some features are downright magical, but there's more room than ever for improvement at the top. The Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra is more expensive at launch than last year's Ultra and the difference is going to hurt more. The Galaxy S23 Ultra was already packed with features and there's not thing so big and new in the Galaxy S24 Ultra. It just got a little bit better in a lot of ways. The real value could come down the road thanks to Samsung's promise to deliver 7 years of major Android and security updates. That length of long-term support was unheard of only last year, but now we have 7 years of support for the best Android phones, with Apple lagging behind offering only 5 years of support. Samsung can promise breathlessly, but until we get to year 7, we won't know if it will truly deliver. Apple has literally delivered on the long-term promise a dozen times already across a wide range of iPhones. Google and Samsung not once. There is already reason to be skeptical, we read in Samsung's latest terms of service is a notice that the current slate of AI features may only remain free for a limited time. Frankly, we have no idea what that means and it's too early to speculate. But it is weird in a way that seems like Samsung is building legal backdoors to weasel out of expectations. Apple doesn't do that, only time will tell if Samsung holds up. I bought a Galaxy S23 Ultra last year, trading a Galaxy S21 Ultra for it, and I am sad to report that trade-in deals and discounts at launch are not as enticing as they were a year ago. If you are trading up from last year's model, expect to pay hundreds over your trade value. I would still say it's worth making the leap just this once. Older phones are going to be left out of the newest AI features more and more with every update. That means values could plummet the first time Samsung delivers bad news and drops the features built in on the Galaxy S22 Ultra or something even newer. Is this phone worth such a high price? If you are asking that question, you are viewing wrong review. You want the Galaxy S24 Plus, which is probably worth it. This is the Ultra, this is the extreme phone, the one that does what no other phone can do. You can't put a normal price tag on Ultra, it doesn't fit. The Galaxy S23 Ultra was our overall best camera phone of last year, so rumors that Samsung would be dropping the optical zoom from 10x to 5x set off a flurry of concern. The 10x zoom was the standout feature on the Galaxy S23 Ultra, aside from the 200 megapixel sensor, the two zoom lenses, the 100x digital astrophotography, the AI image enhancements, and everything else the phone could do. Still, it's odd for Samsung to take a step backwards, especially where specs are concerned. Let's start with the Galaxy S24 Ultra's 5x zoom lens. Samsung has not taken a step backwards, more a step sideways. The Galaxy S24 Ultra still has the best zoom camera you can find on a smartphone. It is better than the Galaxy S23 Ultra's 10x zoom and it's much better than the 5x zoom you will find on the iPhone 15 Pro Max most of the time, like when you are really using the zoom to its full extent. 
when you zoom in to 10x or even 100x the galaxy s24 ultra produces images with better color and much better dynamic range than the galaxy s23 ultra where the older camera made images look flat you will see more depth and shadow with the galaxy s24 ultra what you won't see is plenty of detail samsung has sacrificed the fine details in images for better overall quality it's good trade those 10x and 100x zoom images from the s23 ultra look terrible sure you could make out some details but they are mixed with noise and blur like a virtual chopped salad on the galaxy s24 ultra you won't see as much but you will be happier sharing those photos because they actually look like good pictures rather than police evidence Check out some camera sample from Galaxy S24 Ultra and some comparison between Galaxy S24 Ultra, S23 Ultra or iPhone 15 Pro Max. A refreshed design does not make a true upgrade. New features, new technology and lifestyle enhancing alternations too. And the Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra has all of this along with seemingly every other features or specification bump you could want from a new phone. Not only is it worth buying if you don't already own a Galaxy Ultra phone, I'd even say it's worth buying if you have a Galaxy S23 Ultra. It's really that good. Obviously, you don't need to upgrade your Galaxy S23 Ultra, but it's heartening to discover Samsung hasn't just sent out a bog refresh of its most expensive non-folding phone this year, which is really what it did with the Galaxy Z Fold 5 over the Galaxy Z Fold 4. The Galaxy AI stuff is being pushed hard and while some of it is worth your time, it's not a reason to choose the Galaxy S24 Ultra on its own. It's a combination of all its parts from the amazing battery life to the genuinely improved camera that makes it a must buy. Although I say it's even worth an upgrade from the year old Galaxy S23 Ultra, I do think you should mostly go into the Galaxy S24 Ultra with the intention of keeping it for years. Quite apart from Samsung's efforts to use more recycled materials, the software update commitment, the sheer ability of the device and the price bump all shout, keep me in all Honestly, I don't think you will tire of the Galaxy S24 Ultra or reach its full potential anytime soon. Buy it and keep hold of it as you simply can't do much better. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.